Morning Froggy, also known as Sophia Frog Song, and this is 10 Minutes of Star Stable, starting now. Okay, so this week there are a lot of really cool things that we can do. There is an open house going on at Jorvik Stables, or I can continue to work on my quest in the Valley of the Hidden Dinosaurs. So I'm thinking uh, I should work on my quest. Otherwise, it's never going to get done. And I really want to see that dinosaur, which right now all I see is a bunch of snow. So we're going to run over to Veldel Village. Yep. Pay my shillings, kind sir. And uh, try to see what's happening. I have my beautiful horse that can handle cold weather. I'm already dressed in my sweater, so it looks like I am ready to do this. So let's do this. I love Veldel. It's one of the prettiest like little villages in Star Stable because it's got all the pretty flowers everywhere. All right, and I got a cursor right in the middle of the screen. All right, there we go. Now we're gonna run up to the opening. Be really nice if one day I can get a trailer and I don't have to go this way every single time. Just saying, that's probably doable. I don't know, I haven't gotten that far. I'm only level 16 and uh, it's taken me months to get through this quest because I keep getting distracted by all the really cool things that they keep doing in this game. Like magical ponies and open houses and more horses. Oh, they've got that new horse in right now. What, what is that? Uh, um, I forget the name of it, but I want one. I always want the horses when they come out. Ugh, I need to actually focus on leveling up the horses that I have because Otherwise, I'm just gonna have a whole bunch of horses at level two, and that's not cool. All right, oh, I have to get off my horse. We have got to the transport. I know, I'm trying to get down. And the computer is fussing at me. All right, here we go. Into the magical elevator with the blue sparkles, and I'm going down the elevator. Yay, yay, yay. I don't understand why I can't ride, get on the elevator with my horse, but you know, maybe it's a safety issue. The elevator safety people have decided that you have to dismount from your horse to take your horse onto an elevator. Okay, which way now? Oh, but I have a little sp uh, red spot on my screen, so let's go that way. Um, I think I get to explode something today. <laughs> this sounds so crazy, but yes, I think today I get to blow open or blow up all that snow. Okay, let's see. Hey, Elizabeth, what's going on? What are we doing today? Take some cow stones and place them on the ground by the ice. All right, and then what I do? Because you have the honor of doing it. You know what, you could have did it for me. I mean, you've been sitting here this whole time and she's gonna give me a dress for doing it. Okay, well, yeah, if I get a dress for putting these stones over there, I'll do it. Yes, will do. Probably should have paid better attention to all the exact instructions, but usually I can figure it out without doing too much reading. That's a horrible thing to say. All right, let's go into our log here. Here's the crystals. See, I'm right, placing the crystals. And take cover. Oh, 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 hurry up. She said take cover, take cover. Right there. No, don't, don't go too far. Gotta go back to the sparkles. Oh, I'm really bad at this. Stop. Oh, and now I gotta use this. All right, what, I don't know what it was, a wand? Oh, I can't do this on my horse. Okay, all right, dismount. And no, don't go backwards. You're gonna go near the explosion. All right, there we go. All right, here we are. I can see the target right over there. I don't know if it's target, what is this? It's a wand rune something I don't know <gasps> something's happening what's happening oh okay come on oh there's like sparkles I'm using magic I'm magical and I did it yay I've opened up more of the map so now what happens where's my horse all right Elizabeth hey I did it, did you see that? I used sparkles and it was like all amazing. <laughs> Fantastic job. I know, I'm so amazing. Um, hope it didn't start any avalanches. Oh, good point. That would be bad. 
Okay, what else do we need to do? Good luck. Come visit again. Yeah, will do. And thanks for the dress. <laughs> thanks a lot. All right, now what do I do? Uh, let's get on my horse. And this is Gold Rocket. I've been working on leveling Gold Rocket up. Got to level five. And now I get to go and explore the Explore Road. I've never been over here before because the ice has blocked the way. And now I'm in this special part that still looks like more ice. Um, am I missing something here? Oh, I guess I gotta go through this area. So where is these dinosaur bones? Come on, I did all this work. I fixed the elevator. I exploded some stuff. Ooh, cool. I'm at a campground. Hey, what's up, Nick? Is that a floating door? I don't understand. Hey there, Nick. All right, what's going on? Yes, I'm a real life person. Pretty awesome, huh? Yeah, um, he says talk to Nick. Yes, I can do that. And we have a friend request. What's up? Yes. Okay. Now, let's see, Nick. What do I have to do? Yes, yes, Nick. Keep going. He's stuttering. He's freezing. What's going on? Main goal with the balloon expedition is to be able to find a secret place. Nice. All right, secret place, balloons. This sounds really fun. Uh, I'm not reading all this. You're talking too much, Nick. Listen to Nick. Oh, well, that's a part of the job, to listen to Nick. Now that we've listened to Nick talk about all this stuff, I really don't know, I wasn't really paying attention. He says that we can go um, look for equipment or do a sandbag stockpile. Do I have to right now? Uh, I really just want to explore. Nick, I'll be right back. I got to find those dinosaur bones. And if they're over here somewhere, I really want to find them. This is the frozen bone. I mean, what am I saying? This is the frozen road. And is it going to take me someplace cool where there's lights? Cool lights. Everything's all frosty. And there's trees. Um... Is that it? I just see more frost and ice. Oops, sorry, Gold Rocket. I was really paying attention to the lights. I wasn't even paying attention to the fact I was about to run you into a fence. That wasn't cool. Where is this dinosaur? Ugh. All right. Um, is that a frozen lake? Ooh, can I go out on it? Can I walk on it? I can walk on the frozen lake. This is cool. Uh oh, okay, don't do that. Don't go off the frozen lake into the water. That's, that's bad. Sorry, Gold Rocket. I am so sorry. Um, but there's like little bridges that help get you over. Yeah, where's the dinosaur? <gasps> is that the dinosaur bones? Oh, no, okay, there's the dinosaur bones. I have found it. How do I get over there? Um, let's see, can we jump across this and then jump here? Yay! There's the dinosaur! I finally made it to the dinosaur! I am like so very happy with myself right now. And uh, this is really cool. And kind of, wow, it's kind of weird. I'm going horseback riding near dinosaur bones. Can I go inside? Nope, maybe not that way. Wow, those are, wow, Mr. Dinosaur, what large teeth you have. But you can go inside the rib cage. Oh, this is so cool. Okay, so what did you do today? I don't know, I went horseback riding in a dinosaur, you know, it's a normal day. Well, here in Star Sable, it definitely is a normal day. Oh, oops. I'm, I'm taking it too far. I'm trying to get onto the actual fossil. See, this is why there's guardrails at museums and stuff, because of people who try to ride their horse onto the back of a dinosaur, and that's like not allowed. Okay, I can't do it. I'm not the best at jumping. 
I'm sure there's others who can. And maybe I just need practice. But right now, this is so cool. Yes, I made it to the dinosaur land today. Oh, perfect timing. All right, so that is the end of our 10 minutes today. We made it to the Valley of the Hidden Dinosaurs and actually got past the, you know, the opening where you get to go down the elevator. This is like a first. I am inside the body of a dinosaur or like the fossil of a dinosaur. I'm, I don't know why this is so impressive to me, but this is, it's really exciting. Uh, thank you for joining us today for 10 Minutes of Star Stable. I am Froggy, also known as Sophia Frog Song. I am on the Night Star server, so if you see me, please say hi. And if I don't respond like right away, that's probably because I'm recording and I'll stop recording to say hi to you. Yes, I will do that. So anyway, thank you for joining us. You are the best. Bye.